introduction reactivity of elements the atoms of the elements in the periodic table react with each other to form new compounds the atoms react due to its tendency to lose gain or share electrons metal displacement reactions a more reactive metal will displace a less reactive metal in a metal salt solution real time example to arrange the metal in the increasing or decreasing order of their reactivity one of the commonly used experiment is by checking their displacement rate this is a reliable technique used because aluminum is actually a reactive metal but due to the protective coating of aluminum oxide on it the results may show that aluminum's reactivity rate is slow apparatus required test tube marker and test tube stand chemicals required aluminum sulfate solution copper sulfate solution zinc sulfate solution iron sulfate solution metal strips of iron zinc copper and aluminum procedure reaction with cuso4 solution take copper sulfate solution in each test tube dip a small clean piece of aluminum zinc iron and copper metal in each test tube respectively record your observations now in test tube a the blue solution of cuso4 becomes colorless also in b the blue solution of cuso4 becomes colorless in c the blue solution becomes green and finally in d there's no any changes reaction with feso4 solution now take feso4 solution in each test tube again dip small clean piece of aluminum zinc iron and copper material in each test tube respectively and now the observations are recorded in test tube a the green solution becomes colorless b is also the same with green solution changing colorless and in c there is no change and in d also there is no change reactions with zneso4 solution now add zneso4 solution in each test tube dip the small clean pieces of aluminum zinc iron and copper metal in each test tube respectively and then record your observation in a there is a reaction seen but then in all other b c and d there's no change and there's no reaction taking place reaction with aluminum sulfate solution add aluminum sulfate solution in each test tube dip a small piece and a clean pieces of aluminum zinc iron and copper metal in each test tube respectively and now the observations are all test tube has no any reactions happening in it conclusion all metals is not displaced by any of the given metals that is aluminum zinc iron and copper hence aluminum metal is the most reactive metal